Ukraine has been executing its right for self-defense according to the Article 51. It's not the Russia that executes. Your perverse reading of the Charter is so sick that it's impossible to interpret. Calling occupational troops peacekeepers, claiming the right of self-defense, lunacy. The Russian troops are suffering heavy losses. Aircraft, helicopters, tanks, trunk, uh, trucks, and most importantly, personnel. You can stop the vote in this chamber. But what may stop the war is unfortunately the bodies and thousands of bodies of Russian soldiers that will be delivered to their mothers in Russia, whether you like it or not, because we have to defend our territories, we have to defend ourselves on our territory. I will be probably also unruly. And I will ask all of you to dedicate a moment of complete silence to pray or to meditate if you do not believe in God for peace to pray for souls of those who have been already killed, for souls of those who may be killed. And I invite the Russian ambassador to pray for salvation. Please, ladies and gentlemen, let us spend a moment in a complete silence. I do apologize, but before moving to a moment of silence, I want to include in the list those people who perished over all these years in Donbass. They also are worthy of being mentioned. Any, uh, all human lives are valuable. Let's not forget them either. But let's, ladies and gentlemen, spend a moment in complete silence. Thank you. I thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Let me continue with my statement. I'm saddened. However, 